As a result of doing something brand new, it's always nice to have a group that's been doing this for decades, thinking about the new ways that we can actually unlock the sky. The primary focus for the Elroy Air and NASA collaboration is about how to better integrate autonomous aerial transportation into the airspace. Unmanned or automated cargo aircraft integrating into our national airspace is really essential and the possibilities are, are quite endless. As part of our collaboration with Elroy Air, NASA is really looking forward to understanding the unmanned logistics use case. We're focused on whether it is possible to automate all these things that have to happen in an aircraft after it lands to make sure it's ready for the next mission, for the next flight. From Elroy Air, we get great insights on the challenges they're facing in designing and building and getting these kinds of large aircraft certified that really inform the way we're designing the system that, that can have robots going in and doing the things that are done today by humans. In some of these austere environments, it's challenging to have a person actually sitting there physically inspecting the aircraft, but that doesn't stop the need for being able to have essential goods reach that community. The spot robots are a great example of a technology that can actually go and pre-inspect our aircraft, post-inspect our aircraft, and make sure that it's as safe and reliable as it needs to be for it to complete its missions. So these missions where you have these robotic aircraft with robotic ground crew operating at locations where there are no humans have reminded us of the Mars missions that NASA flies. The types of operations that we talk about at Mars and we see in different missions are very similar to the kind of things that we're talking about now. And we look for inspiration to those Mars missions and we look for how they might inform us of the problems we have here on Earth.